Hi everyone, I'm here again with Emma, my daughter, and tonight we are going to talk about maybe a problem that you have in your home with kids with long, beautiful, beautiful hair, and moms that have hair too. Anyways, so we want to talk about these things, brushes, and all the different types that we have here in our house that um, we have used over the years. We have we'll used, um, we will display them, we'll show them, they're right here. There's just a small snippet of what we have in our stock here at home. So we want to talk about every single one. Um, some of them have been with us longer than others. Others have just come to our house recently and um, these are not the first we have had or the last I'm sure, but um, I'm sure there's lots of people in our same situation with little girls with hair or boys with hair that um, need brushes on a daily basis. Sometimes we have multiple of the same because we have lost them multiple times and we never know where they are. You could be anywhere in our house and possibly come across a brush. So there's like every a brush in every nook and cranny. <laughs> there's a brush in every nook and cranny of our house. Gym bags, cars, backpacks, bathrooms, kitchens, um, everywhere, everywhere, drawers, everywhere. <laughs> You're right. So. Um, Let's see. I know I'm saying um a lot. Anyways, okay. so the Can first one, what is this one? This yes. one's like a brushy type, but it tickles my fingers. And uh -huh. It's like... It has like a metal core, so it's good if you're wanting to curl your hair with a blow dryer. I think this was recommended to me by the girl that does my hair. How does that feel? It doesn't really... She just got out of the shower. Does it really untangle your hair? I mean, like, if you want it to be quick and not like not perfect then that's so quick and not perfect that's what you would use it for okay next one next one is almost the same but it's like bigger and it has like bigger um brushes and bristles and bristles. It'd probably be for when you're blowing out your hair and you want bigger um maybe some bigger curls how's that one like if you compare this one to this one this one's a bit worse because like up here yeah. it's not really brushed yeah, so what do you think? Thumbs up or thumbs down for that one? Mm. Eh, okay, what about, okay, thumbs up or thumbs down for this one? Mm, I would yeah, use thumbs it one. again. Okay, what about this one? This I one, I don't know where it came from. I, I didn't buy it. It, it like randomly showed it. up. Maybe my mom, maybe it belongs to our exchange student. <laughs> I haven't asked, but we this use it smaller. sometimes. And, I like it because yeah. it's smaller, uh -huh. and this one's thinner. It has lots of hair in it, so it must collect lots of hair while you brush. Tell me how that one works. This one looks, works good. Yeah, not so bad. Your hair's kind of drying out. Okay, thumbs let's, up, thumbs down. What do you think? Mm, thumbs up? Okay. Let's see if use this one, one I've yes. had for a very long time, um, and I think I've had multiples of these, but then I just recently was told by the girl that cuts my hair not to use anything that has metal because it's going to fry my hair. I have really thin, fine hair. She does too. Her sisters don't. They have really thick, beautiful, Italian mm. side from my husband hair. So how about this one? Ow. It hurts uh -oh. my head. It, like, yeah. If you brush it on your bangs, if you have bangs, then it hurts you. Uh -huh. and, ow. It hurts. Does it get into the tangles? It, it gets ow. into the tangle, but it hurts. Okay. It's very heavy, too. Like, if I hit my head with this, I think that would hurt. But I think with the metal uh, base on the inside, it's supposed to be for blow drying your hair and making it curly. Okay, get that black one. This one is my personal one. I use it at the gym. It's in my gym bag. It's, it goes back and forth between my gym bag and my um, bathroom because this just seems to be the one that pulls through all the tangles for me. Are you making tangles so you <laughs> yeah. can comb out tangles? Get through your chicken feather there too. It's not How's, you don't like that one? No, it's no, not my favorite. Not your favorite? Okay. All right. I mean, if it feels good, but it's not my favorite. It does the job though, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Thumbs up or thumbs down? would use again. You would use again? Okay, get the other one, the uh, long hair, don't this care. This one I really like. Yes, we have, how many of these? We uh, have like four of these. Um, this one has Rapunzel on the I back. I have a stitch one, I have a beauty and It says beast long one. hair, don't care. We have a Cheshire one. Yeah, we, we have, have lots of these. One. Get these at Hot Topic. They're, sometimes you can find them on sale for about five bucks. They're really good. They're really good. Um, honestly, these are the ones we find in every nook and cranny of our house because we have 
lots of them. We just like, keep buying them because really I really like them. Sometimes I find them in our car. <laughs> so you can brush your hair on the way to school? Oh, yeah. 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 We yeah. also have a wet brush, but we couldn't find it. Yeah, but we have another wet brush called the detangler that's up next. It All is right. really So what do you do? Give the Hot Topic brush. Thumbs up or down? Thumbs that's one of our favorites, yeah. That's why we have like five of them. But I, of course, yeah. I can't find them all. <laughs> all right, and our last brush today is called the wet brush. I'm sure it's been heard of before. We love it. It's not the wet it. brush, it's the detangler. It's I know, very but it's different. like the, it's the wet brush detangler. So the difference between the wet brush, so the wet brush typically just has these um, longer little um, bristles. bristles, but this one, if you can see inside, it has smaller bristles, kind of like these. what goes with this on the inside too. And this one, I just got it last week, again, recommended by the gal that cuts my hair, and she said it is the best. And I think it is. It, it makes is. your hair, what, super wet? Super shiny. soft and shiny, and does it hurt? No. 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 No, it doesn't. Look and look at that. Look at that. All right. And whenever I brush my hair with the wet brush, it always makes it really fluffy. Yeah, yeah. So okay, we're buddy. trying our best to brush our hair after the shower so that in the morning when we go to school, we're not screaming and crying and um, using a ton of our detangler to um, get the... the um, tangles out of our hair but so far I think this is the best one that we've found right Em? Yep. Yep. Anyways so what do you say for thumbs up or down? Would use again and again. Definitely use again. We like we had it in the car and I think everybody used it even my son wanted to see how it made his hair feel when I bought it and again got this at Ulta very very easy to find um, so there it is, ladies and gentlemen, our little quick review of the millions of brushes that you find in the Brook home. Um, thanks for watching, and uh, what do you say? Bye-bye. See you next time. Bye. Oh, what a face.